City, you're coming back to perform at the Ring Theater. Do you think that you'll be as popular as you once were? If this is not popularity, yes. Look around. Try to find a ticket to my concert tonight. I impossible. Ah, that Valente. Still as smooth as ever. Lieutenant Vega. Friedrich's here. What's this about? I'm not sure that I understand, sir. You claim to have information concerning an extortion ring. What? A corrupt police officer? Hmm. A rendezvous tonight at the docks. And who, may I ask, are you? Seems serious. Gentlemen, I want you to stake out the docks tonight at 2 a.m. must be some mistake. It's Lieutenant Vega. Well, that doesn't shock me at all. Friedrichs to all units. Wait until he takes the suitcase before you move in. Come on, take it. <laughs> Police, freeze! Uh, don't do anything stupid, Lieutenant. Senator Dobbs, hello. What do you think of the skimpy new outfits the waitresses at the DNA Club are wearing? Outrageous. Absolutely scandalous. Ah, so, you admit to having been there then, Senator? Ace, Miss Lesage has just arrived. Send her in, Angel. I think we'll call it quits for now, young man. Senator Dobbs? No, it's Ace. <gasps> oh! Ace Cooper, at your service. It's awful, Mr. Cooper, just awful. They put him in jail. Who? Well, Lieutenant Vega. They've charged him with bribery and extortion. Please, you have to help him get out. Oh, just, Vega? Just, just, but this has to be just, a mistake. Just, Come on, calm down, miss. We all know he's the only honest cop in Electro City. Yeah, Vega's more honest than Mother Teresa. Angel, how does Vega's situation look? Not good. The media has picked oh. up on the story. And in headline news today, the police of Electro City have arrested one of their own. Early this morning, a police officer, Lieutenant Vega, was arrested in connection with extortion and bribery charges involving several local casinos. <gasps> now let's go to Duke Paparazzo on location for more on this breaking story. Hey, Lieutenant Vega. What do you have to say to those who say that? <laughs> Miss Lesage, have you noticed anything different about Vega lately? Anything out of the ordinary? Well, no. No, I, I can't think of anything. 
I wonder if the bail has been set. His bail has been set at $150 million. $150 million? That's crazy. Nobody can get together that kind of money. Judges are rarely lenient with police officers accused of bribery and extortion. Listen, Captain Friedrichs, if I liquidate all my assets, I can get two-thirds of it together by tonight. Mr. Cooper, I am not a carpet salesman. <laughs> so wise guy, not so wise once you're behind bars, huh? He's been taking bribe for what, 15 years now? Yeah, and guess how much he got? I don't know. Several million? Nuh-uh. Fifteen years. <laughs> Whoa, look who's here. It's the magician. Hi, Vega. Seeing how much the bail was, you'd think you'd have a suite with an ocean view. Vega. If you want me to help you, you've got to confide in me. Just tell me, what the heck were you doing on the docks at 2 o'clock in the morning with a suitcase full of money? I can't tell you anything. Get me out of here, Ace. I'm begging you. Well, I imagine that you know what you're doing, Mr. Cooper. To mortgage all your property to pay Vega's bail shows an incredible amount of trust in him. You should know that Lieutenant Vega has already been at the heart of a scandal that sullied the police department's reputation 15 years ago. He was found guilty of aggravated assault on the same victim as last night. Where do I sign? I'm impressed by your commitment to your old friend, Mr. Cooper. Also, the procedure will take a while. Paperwork, you understand. Come on, baby, I'm gonna take you to the stars. La, 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 la. I'm Why would Vega be interested in this Valenti character? Well, <sighs> you can't get any cheesier than that. Angel. Do you have anything on Vega from the police disciplinary files? Scanning? Yes, I have found a case that goes back to 2014, but it's been classified strictly confidential. Hey, nothing's confidential for hackers. It's impossible to get through this system. It's locked tight. You know, maybe we could try with the new algorithms, but, uh, hmm, that might take some time. Uh, I'm not sure Vega can bear another day in that cell. We're gonna find out what's in those top secret files tonight. We're going straight to the source. You want to break into the police station? Whoa, are you nuts, Ace? You got a better idea? Man, when I tell my friends about this... Oh, hold on. You better not tell anyone. Yeah, cool rollerblade ring. Ow! Hello. Hey, you guys, get over here. There's a nutcase who's rollerblading in the hall. Yeah. Hey, you. What do you think you're doing? Turn off the alarm! Magic, Magic Force! Force. Reveal the power within! No lock can resist the magician. It was very smart of you to use Vega as a scapegoat to cover your own deeds. Blackjack was very amused by this. I just hope it doesn't backfire. You've taken quite a risk, you know. Using Vega as a scapegoat wasn't my idea. Is there a problem, Captain? 
No, uh, no problem at all. I'll get hold of you for our next meeting. See you soon, friend. Friedrich speaking. Somebody just broke into my office. I want the police station on full alert. Secret records of the Police Disciplinary Commission. Lieutenant Vega is found guilty of aggravated assault on a singer, Richie Valenti. Valenti taken to the hospital in a coma. Valenti threatens the police department to leak the scandal, his innocence in exchange for his silence. Don't move! Hiding. Uh. Oh. Ah. Over there, he's escaping. Razzo, you're on the lookout. Rasco, you handle the houses. Ma capo, I'm always on the lookout. That's because you got the best eyes. Ah, I got the best eyes. Ma, doesn't that mean I am also got the lesser good ears, huh? Did I say that you got a worse ears than you, brother, huh? Did I tell you that? Put that away and go open the door, hey. Um. Uh, hello. Uh, I'm here to uh, room the clean. Uh, uh, clean the room. It's okay, guys. Uh, hello, miss. You can start with the bedroom. Oh, uh, blended. Uh, thank you, Mr. Valenti. Let's get back to business. You have two hours to do the job and no more. Well, maybe a little bit more, what with the encores for my dear oh. fans. So what you're saying is that Vega would have been afraid if Valenti revealed to the press a sordid story of a beating that's over 15 years old? If we imagine that Valenti holds all the necessary documents to break the scandal, and Vega wants to get them back, what does he do? Sets up a meeting with Valenti, ordering him to hand over the documents. Valenti makes as if he accepts and goes to the docks at the appointed hour. But he warns the cops and the trap closes on Vega. But a suitcase full of money doesn't look like anything but a payoff, right? Ah, that's just what Valenti wants us to believe. His trap worked perfectly. Uh, sorry, dude. It doesn't hold water. I mean, why would a famous singer like Valenti take so much risk to bring down a cop like Vega? They hadn't seen each other in, like, 14 years. Ace, Miss Lesage is on the line. Oh, Mr. Cooper, finally, I've got you. Oh, it's terrible. Valenti is preparing a series of robberies. But I guess Vega has known about it for a long time. I looked at his notes, and that is why Valenti had to stop him. Good work, Miss Lesage. Oh. Boss, Vegas gonna be released. Oh. Somebody put up his bail. Yeah, aside from that, we've also decided who's gonna be on lookout tonight. There's a no more lookout, idiota. Change your plan. You stay with me tonight. Friedrichs, I'm listening. Friedrichs, you traitor. You haven't upheld your part of the bargain. It was agreed that the bail would be high enough that Vega couldn't be freed. But I couldn't have foreseen that. It won't be long before Vega shows his face here. And we're gonna give him such a welcome from which he'll never recover. So? 
He's just been released. I'm afraid he may do something foolish. Valenti! The Ring Theater! Attention! The train is in the station now. Have a move on it, Ratso. We got visitors. Don't move. Punches are magic! I think this is a what are you looking for? <laughs> Who would have thought that your left hook would have such a long lasting impact? We know you know them. These are the guys who are burglarizing all those houses while you strut your stuff up on stage. Own up. Hey, Lieutenant of Vega, calm down. I know your life as a police officer is already hard enough as it is. There must be some kind of agreement you and me can come to, huh? You think I'm for sale? As soon as I have sufficient proof, I'm gonna put you away, you and your little gang of Sunday burglars. Ah, uh, why you bother kidding yourself playing Mr. Honesty, eh? You're just a loser. I make a hundred times in a day what are you making a month? And you're gonna be a poor third-rate cop the rest of your life. <laughs> okay, I spent a week in the hospital, but I was cleared of all the charges. Thanks to your handiwork. <laughs> Captain Fredericks, Richie Valenti here. Come into the Ring Theater quickly. I have just killed a crazy man who has been persecuting me for weeks. <gasps> I rolled the dice, Vega, and you just lost. Ciao! Valenti, no, not that. Ciao! What is going on here? But, but, how can you already be here? Yes, old friend. I know everything about your organized burglaries. No, you don't know nothing about me, but I know all about you. You are rotten to the bone, Fredericks. I am going to kill both of you. I will make two less crooked cops, see? <laughs> Hands up! Fredericks, but it's you. But uh, what's going on here? Who was that man with you a second ago? Ah, uh, but uh, I don't... No, you don't know nothing about me. But I know all about you. You are rotten to the bone, Fredericks. I am going to kill <gasps> both of you. I will make two less crooked cops. Ah. Uh. Lieutenant de Fredericks! No. Ace Cooper, at your service. <laughs> Check out my Italian accent, dude. Pretty good, huh? <laughs> yeah. Senior Valente, S Senior Valente, just one question. Hey. Ace, I want to thank you. And I apologize. I was so ashamed and worried that people would find out about that old incident that I hid behind a wall of silence. I hope you'll forgive me. Listen, Vega, I wasn't there when you knocked him out, but with what I know now, I'm sure that he deserved it. 